All right, my name is uh, Trey. I live in Houston, Texas. And right now I'm uh, a real estate investor. All right, so uh, I took the program because uh, I just felt like um, I wasn't able to achieve the amount of growth that I was looking to get on my own, just based on the information that you guys give us in the podcast. Um, so I felt like I really needed some, some hands-on, um, you know, kind of like first-hand help with that. And uh, that's why I finally decided to pull the trigger and come on down to L.A. Uh, well, I mean, I had kind of dabbled with a couple of other, uh, a couple of other things, and uh, most of those other programs felt um, kind of like gamey, and it, it's like they were just giving me a bunch of tricks to use, and it wasn't really anything genuine. Um, so at the end of the day, I still had all this, all this same head trash that got me into the situation in the first place. Uh, at first, I was a little bit skeptical, uh, just because. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't see how um, you know you guys could take it in one week and 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 make the kind of transformation that y'all advertised. But uh, yeah, y'all completely blew that out of the water. I'm I'm glad that I that I you know decided to do it. Man, I enjoyed the hell out of it. I had a blast. Um, it was a lot of hard work. Uh, a lot of uh, you know it was weird being out of my comfort zone so much, but. You know that was a, that was a good thing, and now you know being in uncomfortable situations is actually where I like to where I like to be, because it means that I'm you know continuing my growth as a person. Saturday night, uh, we got an Uber driver, and I was um, you know chatting her up and applying all of the things that I had learned, and you know ended up ended up getting her number when she dropped my when she dropped me back off at uh, at AOC. So it works. <laughs> Working on my own, I wasn't able to um, get over my approach anxiety. And um, coming out there and working with uh, you know Johnny and um, and AJ and uh, Fern and <laughs> and Samim, they they really pushed me to uh, to overcome that. And um, <clears throat> it's not so much that the approach anxiety is completely gone, but I just I know how to deal with it now, and it doesn't hold me back nearly as much as it did before. Oh yeah, absolutely. I'm I'm constantly, um, you know, going back over it in my mind and <clears throat> excuse me, going back over it in my mind, and going through the lessons and uh, all the all the stuff that uh, that was presented in the lectures, and um, you know, kind of trying to consciously apply that to my day to day life, and uh, it's going pretty well for me. Oh hell yeah, I'd absolutely recommend it, bro. I actually already have recommended it to a buddy of mine. Um, <clears throat> And uh, I've actually had a lot of uh, a lot of girls that I know asking if, if you guys have anything like this for women. Um, so I know there was there was a little bit of talk about that uh, whenever we were there. Um, I don't know how you're gonna pull it off, but if you can, um, I definitely uh, can send some girls your way. I can't put my finger on one one specific uh, type of person that would benefit from it. Pretty much anybody could come through and get value from it. Um, it seems to me like uh, there's there's very few people in the world that are just going through life fully confident and completely full, uh, free of head trash, and um, you know whatever whatever there is that's not that's not really clicking upstairs, you guys can uh, you guys can isolate that and, and completely destroy it for them. So everybody could benefit from it, man. Everybody.